First up at 6, Academy School District 20 has released the results of their investigation into allegations that teachers taped face masks on students. Here's a look at their findings. They say teachers did not affix any student's mask to their face, but the teachers did direct students to affix the mask to their face with tape. And that student believed they were required. Students believe that were required by a teacher to use tape to affix their mask to their face. Tonight, we're hearing from the district and a parent whose daughter shared a photo that was at the center of this investigation. Our Mayo Davison reports. The investigation into the mass taping incident may be over. I was just kind of shocked, like, where's the transparency? But the findings bring no closure to Stephanie and her daughter Riley. Those teachers shouldn't be working there anymore at all. There's no excuse for it. It's been a rough few weeks for her family. She says her daughter has been getting bullied because of the incident. Kids that texted her would say, well, our teachers are going to get fired all because of you. And she got really depressed about that. And those kids didn't realize either that something was wrong. In an apology letter to parents, the four teachers involved wrote in part, it was never our intent to cause anxiety, fear, confusion, or physical or emotional harm. Our team made a mistake in our methods. We will learn from this situation and moving forward, we'll strive to do better and always do what is best for kids. I'm just so mad at them. I'm <laughs> I guess to me it would have been more personalized if each teacher spoke up in person. District 20 says the teacher's actions weren't done in malice. This was a case where teachers really just wanted to keep their students out of quarantines so they could keep them in the classroom and they thought this was the best way to do that and unfortunately it was a bad judgment call. And they're making sure it doesn't happen again. That was for us a reason to talk to our whole community and make sure that they feel like they don't need to be the mask police. They're there to teach, they're there to mentor and support their students. But while the investigation is over. I'm not going to drop it until there's transparency and um, my significant other will, he's been going to all the board meetings and he has been speaking and he will continue to. In Colorado Springs, Mayo Davison, News 5. Mayo, thanks. Stephanie says she's withdrawn her daughter from Chinook Trail Middle School since the teachers were not fired. The district will not say publicly what, if any, discipline has been taken against the teachers since it's an internal personnel matter. They are encouraging any parents with questions or concerns to reach out to them directly. The state's chief medical officer.